So a few of you have asked me in some of my comments, what do I do to maintain my hair? Well, I'm going to give you a little video, basically, of me getting my hair done. Hey, y'all. <laughs> getting my hair done again. I'm doing a detox again because the first detox we did, we did an all right job, but there was still buildup in the hair, so we're going to do it again. And my mom right there is the detox lady. <laughs> and one of the reasons why is because I have a new hair product that I'm going to be trying. And it's an all natural product. Uh, my cousin from Arizona uses it. And she says that she doesn't get build up and all that stuff. Using this product, you don't need gel. Just the product. So... I want to do a good detox, try to get this stuff out before using the new product. You okay? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, we ain't got a lot of room. So, we're going to apply the baking soda, apple cider vinegar, and lemon juice, which we didn't use lemon juice the last time. And we didn't kind of like massage the blocks itself to get some of the buildup from inside the locks. Now, my hair is super duper, uber duper dirty. I know it is. I just know. Have you watched videos on it, mama? I was fin to, but you jumped in the tub. Girl, you knew we was going to do this. You should have been watching them. I watched them before. I'm going to watch them today. Ow, you, mom. Watch where you, uh. Flicking my dick. Be flicking. <laughs> Close your eyes. Mama, mama, you doing too much. Give me a towel. I got a towel. <laughs> Lord. I try to be a little bit more discreet this time. Lord, ooh, that ooh, that's cold. <laughs> Your hair got detoxed pretty good last time. This water was no, nah, it didn't. It's my, my hair dirty. See, you gotta massage the lock. There's a lot more buildup in the lock. Versus the scalp area. See, look all that dirt coming out. It looked like the Mississippi. It's going to look like the Mississippi River, y'all. You want some locks? No, you don't want to go through this? Close your eyes. Lord, here we go again. <laughs> okay, she didn't get me in the ear and stuff this time. Yep, it's starting to look like the Mississippi River, y'all. No, it ain't. It looked worse last time. It's going to look bad. It's been, it's been a while since I washed my hair. I ain't going to tell y'all what it was, but it's been a minute. But the good thing with locks is dirt is kind of good for locks. Yeah. I told her it looked like the Mississippi River, Tasha. Is dirty. Mm-hmm. Ooh, wee. 
Yeah. It looked like Mississippi River. I ain't washed my hair in a minute, y'all. I'm gonna turn this off so I don't embarrass myself too much. <laughs> but y'all get the point. Right, right, right. Did you put enough baking soda? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Quite a bit. It's dirty, ain't it? Mm -hmm. So you should let it sit now for a minute. Yeah. Yeah. Let it sit. Add a little more of that. And let it do its magic. Mm -hmm. Yeah, girl. She was pouring an apple cider vinegar in my ear and stuff. <laughs> I'm like, oh, Lord. <laughs> it might detox your ears. <laughs> you can't even see on this side. <laughs> Oh Lord, here we go. <laughs> bubbles, bubbles. Bubbles, bubbles. Uh oh. Ooh, you got the towel. I told you. That <laughs> was, okay, Mama, that's good. You doing a little much. <laughs> Lord. That's that arthritis yeah, kicking in. That That's that arthritis kicking in. Let go of your face. Just, let that, just let that sit and let that work. And it's so magic. I'll probably sit here for what, 20 minutes? Mm -hmm. Something like, like that. Big mm, Something. All I can tell y'all, somebody got to get my black ass up off this fucking floor. <laughs> Mama, why are you cussing on my Y'all yeah, see, it's working. My hair didn't grow some. Can you tell my, my phone Okay, y'all. This is the new product I'm going to try today. It's called Lock. It's by Lock Nation. It's a lemongrass and honey, plant-based, all-natural ingredients. Okay. And you can look at the ingredients there. So we're going to give this a try. My cousin says she's been using this for three plus years and she won't use nothing else but this. So I'm going to give it a try. So my hair is washed, is detoxed, washed and conditioned. And I'm about to get a retweet. I got a lot of new growth, y'all. <laughs> Lots of new growth right there. Uh, is that gray hair or is that build up? Build up. It is. It is my new hair. Well, you know, it ain't perfect, but you know, a lot of stuff did come out. And this is the lock. Oh, girl, you look rough. I was going to show your face. No, don't do that. <laughs> I was about to say, you look a little. Uh... Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. All right, I'm going to show you. I'm going to show you the finished product when she's done. And this is the moisturizer we're using in my hair. And that's Prince over there. Hi, say hi, Pootie. Say hi. Hi, Pootie. Prince. You want your locks done? You want some locks? Say no. All right, y'all, my head is locked, redid, retwisted. Yeah, y'all, my head mm, looks nice. That's the back. Now we gotta let it dry. Okay, so I never got around to showing you guys the end results of my hair getting retwisted. So I know some of you has have asked me, how do I maintain my hair? What do I do? And you guys, I'm just going to be so straight up honest. I do very minimum to my hair. <laughs> Literally. I do very minimum to my hair. I'm not a high maintenance type chick. So, <laughs> you know, I usually... In between lock, in between retwists, I keep oil in my hair. Um, I'll wash it and stuff like that. And sometimes I may not wash my hair for three weeks or so. And my cousin also gave me some 
Royal Keepers Oil Rosemary. She gave me the rest of hers and said, this is some awesome oil. So I haven't used it yet, but um, when it's time for me to re-oil my scalp, I'm going to use some of this. And I'm, I don't retwist my own hair. Tasha retwists my hair or my mom will retwist my hair. So I usually don't get a retwist until I come back to St. Louis. Um, so it's a little stiff because it's freshly done. But there is my results, guys, of my hair retwisted. I don't normally do hairstyles. I just let it hang and do what it do. But um, that um, Lock Nation um, stuff that I had that my cousin gave me, man, my hair sticking straight up. Girl, get it together whatever y'all it's just all over the place anyways oh well um oh it smells so good that lock nation stuff smells fabulous my hair smells so good so so good and even tasha when she was doing my hair with that stuff she said she likes it a lot. And that's all she re did my retwist with was that one product. There was no gel added, no nothing else. We did put some, that little moisturizer in my hair. Then she retwisted it. And this is a day old, a day old. Yeah. So guys, that's how I maintain my hair. I don't really retwist my hair. Someone else does it for me and I pay them to do it. It's easy for me because I've never been a hair person anyways, okay? <laughs> so I just wanted to put that out there because a few people have left comments wanting to know, what do I do with my hair? How do I maintain my locks? And that's just how I do it. Now the detox thing. Now I feel like this last detox was really good. Um, so I'm not really sure how often we should detox our locks. I'm not sure. But um, we'll see how this product does in my hair. We'll see if it, you know, creates buildup. I don't know. But I normally like to get my retwist done i'm right now on the verge of waiting like two to three months okay and the reason why is because the longer you wait to retwist the thicker your lock will be and i want thick locks um some of them are thicker than others and some of see i like the thick ones <laughs> You know, yeah. So, that's just me. I don't mind looking rough and ragged for a few for a few weeks, a month. Just don't matter to me because I'm not out here trying to impress nobody. Anyways, I just wanted to share that, guys. Nothing special, nothing fancy. That's just what I do. And then if I'm on the road, I just maintain, keep my hair washed, keep it oiled, and keep it moving. And then, you know, eventually, of course, I'm going to always see my mom. And if I'm in St. Louis, Tasha's here. So I always got someone to retwist my hair. So that's not a problem. <laughs> All right. Peace out. Bye.